wrap this arm and almost snake that a little bit. Just It's just going to keep me a little tighter. The more I stay here, the more space creates. Now I'm going to lose it. Okay, so I'm going to reach that near leg. And if I get it, it's easy. Only way he's going to defend that near leg is if he flies that back leg around and it's going to leave the other one there. So the only thing that's going to happen here is my hand's got to move pretty quick. So I got two on one. I'm backpedaling. I reach. He sprawls. I'm actually going to switch. So like everything's going to have to happen here. My hand is going to come down from the leg. It's going to come back up and my feet are going to switch and I'm going to pick the far one. The biggest thing is our, our hand. Our hand's got to move. Okay, so slow motion. He takes a shot. I'm here. I reach. He comes back. And then I'll just check the far one. Depending on, like, just, you'll know because the leg won't be there. Just bring it back up. When I bring it back up, I have to shrug and I got to get my elbow up. Otherwise, if I go here and I go down, I might fall off right here. I need this arm to bump so that I can pick. Here, he circles out. Now I can pick. Okay, on uh, where he's at. All right. And a lot of times their head, even his head's doing a good job of coming um, down, but a lot of times head will be up, so it'll be a, a real easy target. So again. Run, 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 reach. I miss the leg. I'm just switching. Switching hands and switching feet. Okay? Go slow. Get your muscle memory down. Because it's tricky because hands got to move, feet got to move. All right? Go.